Hi lovelies, today I'm going to be doing a colourful summery makeup tutorial so I hope you enjoy it, let's get started. As always I've moisturised before and I'm just going to go in with a primer and I'm using the Illamasqua Hydra Veil because I love this stuff, it's great for priming the skin, just rub it in all over. Make sure you get your neck as well. So next I'm just using Max Face and Body in N2 and I'm just using a buffing brush to work that into the skin. I've actually been really loving this face and body um, as a foundation this summer. So it's a good foundation. I've been using it a lot. So you just work that in all over on top of that primer. So I really like to kind of use more colourful bright colours during the summertime as I think it's like the perfect time to experiment with colours. It's summer, it's the perfect time to be bright and beautiful. Next I'm just taking my concealer just over any red spots or redness and I've got quite a few, I've had a bit of a breakout with all of the sun. And then I'm just going in with that foundation brush that I use for my foundation to blend and buff the concealer in. So I'm just taking NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer just as a highlighter as this is a few shades lighter than my skin tone so it's perfect. I think this product makes like the perfect eyeliner, um, highlighter, I mean. It's a gorgeous, creamy, bright colour. So you will look something like this, a little bit daft, but once we blend it in, again with the buffing blush, it will be fine. So you just work highlight into the skin and I really love using a highlight during the summertime it just gives you that healthy kind of glowy skin look it's really gorgeous so then with my Rimmel matte bronzing powder and my powder brush I'm just going to brush that over the top of my forehead just to give you that sun-kissed look that illusion that you that illusion that you've been in the sun. And through temples, down through the cheeks. Many people make the mistake of taking their bronzer like all over their face. You just you take it basically wherever the sun would hit you. And then I'm using Max Blush in Stay Pretty just to go over the apples of my cheeks. Just a touch of it, not too much. Give it a pretty pink cheeks. So now that my face is all summery, I'm now going to make my eyes all colourful and summer like. So let's get started on them. First I'm using Urban Decay Primer and I'm just going to take this over one of my eyes first because I want to work quickly. I'm taking quite a bit because I want it to be a really creamy base so that I can easily blend out the eyeliner. So I'm just using the Bourjois Smoky Effect Black Pencil and you're just going to dot a line from about the middle you don't have to be neat with this line. Now 
Now I know that's not very neat, but we're then gonna go in with an, a very small angled brush, and this is a MAC 266. And you're gonna neaten that up. And this is why I've used the creamy base to start with. It's better to use a creamy eye pencil if you've got one, but if you use a creamy base to start, it should be okay. Then I'm taking Scandalized Tempting Turquoise eyeshadow stick and what I'm going to do is I'm going to line my waterline with it. The colour on this is just so pigmented, look, can you see? Absolutely gorgeous, perfect for the summer. So then what I'm going to do is from that corner flick, I'm going to work that in. Through the socket. Just on top of that liner. And then with a the base shadow brush, I'm just going to blend that through. And then with this Dolce & Gabbana quad palette, I'm just gonna take this light white color. And this quad palette is amazing. The, the colors are so pigmented. You don't have to use a lot of it and it just comes out really nicely. I'm very impressed with these little quad palettes. And I'm just gonna take that over the inner corner and blend that into the line where the liner is. So it just neatens that out a little bit. And it almost gives this crystallised purpley look. Which, like a sparkly purpley, which is gorgeous. Just a little subtle hint of it. And either you can leave it like that, but I'm going to be a bit more colourful and take this green colour. And this quad palette, by the way, is Dazzling 160. I'm just gonna take this lime green color, just in this outer corner bit here, just as a little slight out inner corner, which is just gorgeous and super colorful for the summer, which I love. Cause I, re I like experimenting with bright, colourful colours in the summer, I think it's the perfect time to do it. You know, it's summer, it's bright, it's pretty, it's lovely, so why not? Great for the sunshine. I just really love that green, it's so gorgeous, especially on the inner corner. This quad palette is amazing, honestly, it's so good. So now that the eyes are done, and I know that's not the neatest I've done it, but I quite like it like that. I think it kind of gives it a bit more of an edgy look, rather than it being super perfect. I kind of like it. It's okay, it's not too bad, but um, I'm not a fan of using um, eyeshadow, uh, eyeliner pencils. I'm not a fan of using them. Um, I think it's a lot easier to use a gel, but it's a little bit more difficult to kind of smudge it out with a gel liner. You can get, it can be quite messy. So now yeah. I'm just using the Maybelline Falsies Mascara. I'm just finishing that look off with the lips and I'm just using this Maybelline Baby Lips Balm over my lips. This is the hydrating one which is perfect to use in the summer with all that heat. You need to keep your lips hydrated. So you can either just leave it as a simple balm across your lips. But I'm going to take that one step further and I'm just going to use this Bourjois Colour Boost in Peach on the Beach. 
to add a hint more colour on the lips. And this is the finished look. I just kind of added this messy boho chic like plait braid that just go pinned it back at the back of my head. So I'll just show you that. Ta-da! I'm not amazing at hair, but I kind of like messy styles, especially in summer. I think it's kind of like a boho, cheeky kind of look. So, yeah, I hope you like it. I hope you like the look and the makeup. It's definitely summer perfect. So, yeah. That's it for today's video. I really hope you enjoyed it, and I really hope I see you guys again soon. Take very good care. Lots of love. Bye.